I'm gonna show you guys how to do this sort of natural makeup look. And it's really simple and easy. It usually takes me like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes to do in the mornings. I do a lot of interviews during the day for extra. I do like Instagram live sessions and everything. So I don't wanna spend like an hour on my makeup. So I usually wear my bonnet, but I figured I wouldn't today. So I'm wearing this headband. First thing I'm gonna do is put on a little bit of uh, tinted moisturizer. This one is Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer 4W1 Tawny. And I always do my eyes first in case I have fallout from my eyeshadow. And so I'm just gonna put some of the tinted moisturizer on my eyes. It's sort of a base. It just helps the um, eyeshadow to look a little better. Right, now I'm gonna do just a little eyeshadow. This is my Too Faced Peach Palette. I'm gonna use the color Puree right here. It's like a light brown. And I'm just gonna put that in the crease of my eye. I'm gonna put uh, a little bit of light eyeshadow on my lid. This is another Too Faced palette. This is their chocolate bar. I'm using this color called So Bougie and I'm just gonna put a little bit of it on my lids. I'm just gonna take my little like blendy brush, it's kind of a small brush. I'm just gonna blend, like there's like this line right here, so I'm just gonna blend that out a little bit. Now I'm going to add the um, same tinted moisturizer, I just used Laura Mercier all over um, the rest of my face now that my shadow's done. And I like using a tinted moisturizer for everyday wear instead of a foundation. So I feel like it's better for me. I'm gonna blend those kind of like I would put lotion on. Next, I'm going to do a little bit of concealer under my eyes. I use the YSL All Hours Concealer. This is in the color three. Just gonna put some underneath my eyes here. And then I'm gonna put some, a little bit on my forehead, just right there. Some on my nose, and then a little bit on my jawline. I'm gonna add a little bit of baking powder to set it. This is from Huda Beauty. This is their Easy Bake Loose Baking and Setting Powder in the color Pound Cake. So I take this sponge and I'm just gonna dab it right here on the inside of my eye and pull it out a little bit. And then I'm gonna apply it again to the rest of the places where I put the concealer. It's called Blunt Matte Powder Blush, yeah. But it's kind of brown, so I like using this. Uh, it's like a darker color sort of do a little bit of contouring. So I'm gonna start here. Um, you go from like this part, that weird part on your ear into your mouth. And then do the same for this temple area right here. And then I'm gonna blend it up around into my hairline a little bit. I'm gonna use this, uh, the perfect face. This is actually a foundation but it's a really dark one, so I like to use it. It's their Y12 foundation, that's the color. I'm gonna take this little flat brush and just add a little bit of lines and darkness right here to my nose. I've got this little brow brush. It's so cute because it's got a little spoolie on the end so you can brush your brows. So I'm gonna take this angled brush and this palette Tartlet and Bloom I'm gonna do the color Activist. And what I'm gonna do is start at the base right here inside my uh, eyebrow and do a line right there at the bottom. And then I'm gonna push the eyeshadow upwards. So then you're gonna do another line here. I like kind of angled, angular brows. So I'm gonna do a line right there at the top and then fill in with the powder I've got on there. And I'm gonna do another line right here on the top and then blend in. I'm gonna use the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural. Take your giant brush, get on as much powder as you can, and then push the powder into your face. 
And now I've got a smaller brush that helps me to reach like underneath my eye and do my nose. So next I'm gonna do some blush. This is the Tarte blushy thing in Captivating. So we're just gonna tap a little bit and then smile. Now we're gonna do a little bit of uh, bronzer. This is called Bronze Goddess. I think this is Estee Lauder. I'm gonna take this fun brush that I just found and just add just a little bit of bronzer. Now we're going to do some eyeliner. Um, this is from Clinique. This is their Intense Chocolate Quick Liner for Eyes Intense. So I'm gonna push it up a little bit and then I'm gonna take a wing out here and then connect the two, little line, and then just color in the lines. And so I can take this and just swipe up a little bit and it'll smudge it, take some off, and it makes that little wing look a little more natural. All right, now I need to take it in just a little more so it looks more blendy. All right, you do the same on the other. And just pray they're even. Crayon that I just use is from Sephora. It's a Sephora Crayon Mini Eye Pencil To Go. Deep Brown, number three. And uh, I use this instead of my Clinique one because this just draws better on my waterline. Curl your lashes. This is their reel from Benefit and I love it. All right, so on the lash, twist a little bit and wiggle up. Same for the inside. Now I'm gonna use this Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil in 1993. This is my favorite lipstick. It's from Urban Decay. Yeah, Urban Decay, it's called Carnal. It's really the only lipstick I use. You gotta finish off with some setting spray. And this setting spray is called uh, All Nighter from Urban Decay. So this is my look. I hope you guys liked that, this, you know, creating this look. Again, I love doing it, it's easy. I don't even put on like fake lashes anymore. I just put on a lot of mascara and I love this look. So I hope you guys enjoyed.